Hey guys, so I just came back from the uh, doing the scent video. If you can't tell, I am indoors right now. I'm back home. Uh, some obvious indicators are there's a ceiling, there's a wall, there's a light there, and my hair isn't as crazy and out of control as it was outside, although it's still quite decently crazy and out of control. But let's get into this part of the video. So other than whatever else happened today happened, uh, something else happened. That's too many happens. And I just said it again. So we got season four. We had maintenance this morning and now we got season four of the tournament. Uh, reward is Diplodocus, which is an exciting, it's not, not that great of dino to be honest. So, uh, the rewards don't really matter too much for this season or the DNA. I mean, the DNA for the tournaments usually don't matter too much, unfortunately. But, you know, some stuff like Bracken Blue, they're nice. They're good standalone dinos. Diplodocus, nah, not so much. Alright, so let's get into one of these matches. My team has been lacking just because I was super busy the uh, last few weeks. Just doing finals, never had the time to go hunt or whatever. My team is basically still the same. I mean, I, I'm not planning on changing any dinos. It's just, you know, the levels. They're kind of stagnant. So, I'm probably not going to do as well as last time. But, you know, I'll try. Well, thankfully we got a really quick uh, matchup here. Sponge, Sukas. This hands, this hands okay-ish. I kind of don't like pulling... Trago and Stegod. Oh, thankfully the uh, the opening favors me. Yeah, I don't like play uh, pulling Tragod and Trico, unless it crits me twice. Unless it crits me twice. Okay, <laughs> I guess that could happen. Uh, I could throw out Tyler Kyrus here. You know what? I feel lucky today. I'm gonna throw out Tricosaurus. <laughs> They're faster, obviously. I'm gonna instance Shacked. Hopefully, they go for Arm Piercing Rampage. Not Arm Piercing, Fan Shining Rampage or Fan Shining Strike, and they did. And they're. Yes, I got the crit, and they're screwed. Goodbye. Uh -huh. Took the risk, and it paid off. I'll take that. The Rathalosaur, the chomper of all chompers that does only. <laughs> <laughs> that much damage. <laughs> and it got one shot. <laughs> Came out, did a bit of damage, and died. <laughs> poor thing, poor thing. That that thing really needs a buff, that thing. Just a slight buff. It's 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 still decent, but you know, it's not working out. Ooh, speed tie. I could have went for the other moves, but it doesn't really matter to be honest, since you know, they're gonna yeah, they're gonna distract impact me anyway, so which then turns my next Rampage into a normal 1 times damage. It's just the same thing. So, you know, I'd rather just have Trico take the uh, impact there so my next Dino doesn't have to take it. Or, you know, the cooldown doesn't come down that fast, I guess. <laughs> That's what I meant. I don't know. All right, like a short defense here. That's an obvious move. All right, I'm going to... I'm going to guess they're going to... Shield here or instead of invincibility because if they don't they're gonna get one shot by the rampage. So, okay, uh, they 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 did it So, uh, I got that one wrong, but they're probably gonna do it next turn now. Come on You can't you can't not go unprotected for two dozen and I'm pinned, which is fun Yep, they went for the shield. Hopefully I land my stun if I don't uh, it doesn't really matter too much, I guess All right, it's done now here's the fun part. I can rampage and run, and I'm pinned, so I don't run. I just throw out a rampage, and the rampage and run only has a one turn cooldown. Oh, this hopped in Stegodius. So, yeah, I'm still here, and the rampage and run comes back again in a turn. So they're gonna probably they're they're gonna think I'm gonna use striking strike, so I'm gonna use superiority strike because I have it up, and you know that's gonna make them use superiority strike. Thus, I'm gonna use superiority strike so I could. Maintain my speed advantage and go for the kill with Rampage and Run. So their pinning strike actually worked in my favor. Merci beaucoup. And uh, sayonara to the Stadius. Poor thing. Didn't stand a chance. Didn't stand a chance. 
Good game, Lucas T. Lucas T. All right, number 73. I don't really care because I don't care too much for the rewards. But let me start that one. Let me open this one up. Let's see what's in there. Coin, start, scally. Fear auction, too. Okay. <laughs> uh, let me see if there's anything around. Nothing around me worth guarding. Can open another one. Let's see. Coin, starts, Parasaurolophus, Miragaya, and Tarjanosaurus. Okay. I don't... At this point, I honestly don't really care what I get from my three hours and eight hours. They don't really matter. They like they the, the amount they give out, like thirty-two mirror guys. The amount is so insignificant; it's it's basically irrelevant. But I'll still take the free stuff. They'll you know pile up. They'll mount up to a decent amount. Maybe you know if I open up enough incubators in a month, I might get one fuse for. Dilaranosaurus, who knows? It's, it's you know, they, they I think they need to buff the incubators a bit. The incubators really don't give too much stuff at the moment. But anyways, I'm going to go find another match, and when I do, I'll uh, see you guys then. All right, we got another match, which is nice. We want matches. Um, you know, or else I don't know how this video would keep on going if I don't get matches. But here we are. Ooh, this hand is really bad. <laughs> I'm gonna start your next. Probably gonna lose this one. This I don't know how to play this one. <laughs> okay, striking rampage. I hate this. Every time it's the setup. Spontosuchus. I'm gonna go for the uh, impact and run. That should take it out unless it swaps out, which they usually do, and I get away safely with my Uterenix. Well. Relatively safely. I mean, the thing with Uterenix, you could preserve... Oh, let's see if they're smart enough to use Purity Strike here. Because if they use Purity Strike, I'm screwed. But if they don't, then, you know, they're going to get destroyed by Tonanto Rex. And they didn't use Purity Strike. They went for the damage. They got greedy with the damage. And now you're going to get punished by that. The right move for them there is to use Purity Strike. Purity Strike... Then, you know, stun, rampage, and I'm down. Down, this Dinosaur Rex thing. Then try to rampage. Although it doesn't, it doesn't really matter too much. The, uh, you know, the second dino, they could always have something come in, take this thing out as a revenge kill. Ooh, not Stegoceratops, though. That doesn't work. Stegoceratops doesn't work in this situation. So they're going to waste an impact on me, which is fine. I'll take that. Uh, let me see who I'm going to throw out. Maybe Trico for this. Yeah, have a Trico. Why not? Because I kind of still want to save my Dialer Kyrus for a cleanup later. So, they're going to stun me. Probably the impact, so I'm just going to use this just to soften up the hit. It doesn't matter too much. You know, I'm going to miss two turns anyways. Or potentially three turns, I mean, but... Oh, they swapped for Spontosuchus. This is weird. But uh, anyways, I guess I'll just sense distraction here then. And they'll uh, they'll die to the counter. I'm pretty sure they will. Instant traction hit me with a lethal wound, and uh, chomp, dead. Poor thing, poor thing. Didn't stand a chance. All right, so two more turns before Trico goes down. Stegoceratops. I don't think that has enough damage to take me down in this one turn. Slow impact, even if it does take me down. Oh yeah, it's going to take me down. I get a fan shining rampage in from a Trico with the counter. So, you know, it's a good trade-off for me. I'll take that. And I get to throw my Dialer Kyrus to set up now. That's why I uh, didn't throw out Dialer Kyrus earlier. Okay. Wait for the Stegot in the back. I knew it! I knew it! Every time I throw out a Dialer Kyrus, it's a Stegot in the back. But let's see if they're, you know... Smart enough again this time because of the move they're gonna go is for go for his Spirit Strike when they should be going for Thagomizer. Watch them use Spirit Strike. The Spirit Strike again, back to back. This matchup, I love this matchup. <laughs> Some people just really get baited by the uh, distracting strike. That's why I love Dollar Kyrus' move set so much. It's so versatile. It works so well. All right, goodbye, Stegadius. And that's, that's another match in the bag.
Hopefully that jumped me up a few spots. If it doesn't, it does, it's all right. I don't really care. All right, 60, that's okay. All right, a 15 minute incubator. That's nice, I guess. I already have one cooking, so I can't really open that one. Oh, oh could get the like, daily incubator. Be nice to have some baryonyx in here. If I don't, uh, or not baryonyx, irritator. <laughs> if I don't get it. Oh, baryonyx, hey, I got baryonyx! And I said it, went, ooh, 100 Alanka. So I got the uh, jackpot for that pick there. Uh, I don't get that often. That's like probably my second time ever getting the jackpot on the epic, but uh, let's do one more before we finish this. And um, I'll see you guys when I do find that last match. All right, guys, so it took me a while to find this match. And this match is unfortunately against a bot. And you'll know it's against a bot when uh, the game tells you crit impact here. If I crit, it should one shot it, by the way. Yep, one shot. Um, the game tells you that you're fighting a bot, so unless unless there is that message, then you are not fighting a bot. The only circumstances where you are fighting a bot is when that message shows up. Swap with Trico. So there, there's a bit of, uh, I'd say, uh, wait, did I not click it? Yeah, here. There's a bit of a, a misinformation, I'd say, uh, going around that, you know, we fight bots a lot, we're all fighting bots, but, you know, that's not... It's not really true, um, that's partially true. You only fight bots if the game tells you you're fighting a bot, otherwise uh, you're not fighting a bot, you're fighting an actual person. Arm piercing impact, I'm gonna take this thing down. Fortunately for them, the bot didn't, wasn't smart enough to use accelerating impact on turn two, so that's gonna get eaten. Magna Purator. So, uh, I don't think it one-shots me, unless it gets a crit, which it does have a 20% of critting, okay. That's that's not too horrible. I'm still in a good position here. Let's go. F Ooh, it's gonna throw out that rampage, eh? I'm gonna you to renex this one. It's gonna rampage me and and hurt a lot. But then my rampage is gonna hurt a lot as well. Ouch! Thankfully they didn't crit this time. Ooh, really? 18 HP? 18 HP. Jeez. I guess I need one more level to one-shot a, a level 25 Magna Purator. It swapped into Echo. They're going to eat that stun, so they're going to get stunned for this turn. And an impact and run. Yep. This is GG. And there you go. Also, another indicator. Just in case you did not see the huge words um, in front before you fight a bot that, you know, the game. You could choose if you want to fight a bot or not. Uh, it lets you choose if you want to fight the AI or not. Um, another indicator is over here, you gain zero trophies, you gain or lose zero trophies, you win or lose, you just get the incubator. It's just for those people at the top, at the tip top who, you know, there aren't that many people in this range, so it's hard to find other players to fight, it takes a while, and, you know, it's just for the top players so they could actually get their incubators, if they, you know, just want to get their incubators or get their uh, daily missions done. Uh, that's why bots exist. Um, it's not to give them trophies. They do not gain trophies from them. So, you know, uh, that used to be a problem. Not anymore. So, thankfully, uh, they kind of fix it. I like this fix, actually. Um, I don't have to farm bots all day, and that's not fun. And, you know, it's it's quite, a, it's quite a, amusing fighting against actual uh, real players, which... I was for the most part. I most of my battles were against real players, anyways. Before it's just rarely. Sometimes you know when really no one's around, they'll you know pair you up with a bot. But yeah, that's it for this video. Season four, obviously, has begun. Good luck, everyone, and hopefully you guys do well in the tournaments.